What's going on here, gents, bearded ladies, babies, uh, brothers and sisters, aunts and uncles, grandmas and grandpas, adopted parents, foster parents, dogs, cats, whatever. It's Main Life, aka the Bearded Mandalorian, aka the Corporal of the Beard, and today we are doing a real quick review of a company uh, that I was honored and privileged to try, uh, Black Bottle Beard Company, and this is their, uh, the, I'm sorry, the Naughty Lumberjack scent. Stay tuned, guys. All right, guys, and we're back. Uh, this is going to be a real quick review, like I said, on Black Bottle Beard Company and their Naughty Lumberjack. Um, let me just start off by saying quality Flipping ingredients matters in product, and uh, and that goes for carrier oils and essential oils. Uh, this company has the carrier oil game on lock. I absolutely love everything that's in this blend, um, and I it did amazing stuff for the old chin carriage. Uh, it really, really did the undercarriage, the chin. Uh, I got my mask line in. Sorry about that, uh, but it really did some great, great stuff. Uh, in terms of uh, controlling that chin itch and everything else, and it's because of the quality of the ingredients. My man, MJ, who owns Black Bottle Beard Company, has put some effort and some time into making a quality product uh, that reflects in its usage uh, and, and how well it performs. I mean that. Uh, let me just list some of these off for you real quick. Obviously, we got hojiba oil. Uh, obviously, we have, uh, obviously, we have coconut oil in there. We have sweet or I'm sorry, we have uh, Jamaican castor oil in there. We have grapeseed oil in there. Uh, we have, uh, oh man, what was a couple of the other ones. Uh, uh, there's a Moroccan uh, uh, tree nut oil that's in there. Um, we have some quality flipping ingredients in this uh, uh, makeup that just really bring a, a nice product to the forefront and performs really, really well in the beard. Now, the Naughty Lumberjack was advertised as a holiday scent. Uh, you can see the little uh, pine or fir tree on there. Um, let me just tell you, uh, it was great during the holidays. No lie there. Uh, but this is a scent that can be worn all year round. This is a scent uh, uh, that is plainly a nice, earthy, uh, tree, aromatic, woodsy uh, uh, kind of scent. And, and, and it, it, it is rivaled to none. I mean, it really is just a very nice uh, I don't want to say light scented, but it's definitely not overpowering. It plays well with the old nose as it sits in the beard and stash. It's just a great, lovely, uh, uh, earthy type tree-like scent. You get the pine, you get you get like the fresh mountain air that comes through there. You get all of that, and again, advertised as a holiday scent. Uh, he released it uh, to be you know and and and, advertise, and promoted it as a holiday scent. But this is a scent that you can wear all year round. And best believe, I'll be rocking this stuff until it's gone. Uh, the Naughty Lumberjack is just an absolutely amazing, amazing uh, smelling beard oil. Now, I listed off some of those carry oils for you. Um, some of those are expensive carry oils. We all know that castor oil is a little bit more pricey, right? Uh, and it starts getting more pricey when you start talking about specifics uh, of where the oils uh, um, uh, come from and, and, and so on and so forth. So know that this product is going to run you a little bit more. Uh, he's got it set on his uh, Etsy page or Etsy, whatever. Uh, at twenty-two dollars for for an ounce of beard oil, um, I think that's spot on. Uh, 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 it could be a little, it could be a little less. Uh, I definitely don't think it could be any more. Uh, but I, I think twenty-two dollars is, is is worth the investment into something that uh, is going to perform well and very well in your beard. Uh, and this stuff is, like I said, it's got that nice carrier blend. Um, he hasn't switched over to the newest trend yet, which is the emu and ostrich oil. He's keeping it the same way he's been doing it. Uh, and making quality, quality products uh, out of the, uh, the carrier blend that he's perfected and that he enjoys. And I got to tell you, my chin enjoyed it as well. Um, so twenty-two dollars, I think, I think is in that realm of of being uh, right where he should be in terms of his quality and the the oils and stuff that he's using. Okay, uh, if you're looking to check out a really cool company with a really cool owner, a small batch company, uh, he makes everything himself, no fancy big website. He's got an Etsy page he sells everything, or an SD page he sells everything on. Um, go over, check out Black Bottle Beard Company, my man MJ's company. Uh, I'm telling you, he got in the beard game, as I said before, to make quality product, and he's doing it. Uh, he's backing it up. This is this is an owner like Carrie from Define Beard Co., uh, my man Clint over in, out of Texas with a... Um, the Captain Stash, these owners, and, and many, many more. Uh, Texan, uh, Tex with uh, uh, Barbara Brand Beards, many, many other owners. 
who came out of the beer game and got into the uh, product making game solely to make quality products. They don't care about releasing uh, scents like that, that, and that. They don't care about uh, 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 making a profit right away. They care about providing bearded men with quality product. And my man MJ has definitely done that with uh, Black Bottle Beard Company. I highly recommend you go check him out. Uh, I have a couple scents I'm going to be purchasing from him here in the future. Uh, if I can get a promo code going on like that, I'll drop it later. But right now, go support MJ and his company. Go support a guy who's putting in everything he can into making a company a lot, lot, uh, a lot better uh, and making quality, quality product. All right, guys? You know me. That's my reviewer on Black Bottle Beard Company. Go ahead and keep it bearded.